Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. My name is Robin. Uh, hopefully you're a subscriber. If you are, then you know kind of what this channel is about. But I've got a video for you today, which I am uh, very, very excited about making. As you can see, I'm very relaxed, uh, sitting on the floor in my bedroom with my head up against my bed, which is nice. But I have a very, very exciting video, and before we do this, uh, I would like you to just go check out one thing. Uh, I would like you to open a new tab in your web browser, whichever you do use, and uh, write in this, kickstarter.com. So with Kickstarter, uh, developers can post their ideas, they can post their projects, and they can uh, uh, see if people are interested in what they're doing. So once you get to Kickstarter, I would like you, wonderful people, to search for something called Initone, and we're going to hit it. And here we go, Imitone Mind to Melody. Uh, this is a fantastic, fantastic project that I checked out. And uh, I got in touch with uh, the very talented Evan Bolster, who's down here. And Evan, uh, out of the goodness of his heart, decided that I uh, could be allowed to play around with the product that he's working on, which is Imitone. Now, what is Imitone? Well, um, let me show you. Imitone is, in its very basic essence, it is a audio to MIDI converter that works in real time uh, and is independent of your DAW. So what it does is it takes a audio signal from, in this case, my built-in microphone. Um, this is a very early alpha stage, as you can see here. It is version 0 0.4.0. So we are still uh, smoothing out the kinks, and I have been able to be in that privileged position where, where I can help out with that. And I would like to share my experiences with you. So basically what it does is it takes an audio signal and then it analyzes that audio signal, finds the root note, and then converts that to MIDI in real time. And it does it very cleverly with very little lag for what it's doing. Um, and the truly elegant part of it is is that it's a completely standalone application and it integrates itself into your system just like a USB MIDI controller. So you can open up any DAW you want and it'll just notice the tone straight off the bat usually. Reason you might have to go and uh, and do some do a little bit of setup because uh, uh, they have sometimes have trouble noticing things that aren't listed. But I've used it with Ableton Live 9. Uh, I've got Logic Pro 9 in the background, and that's working absolutely fine. I haven't tried it with Pro Tools yet because I haven't actually like started my day um, properly, so I haven't plugged in my iLock and all that good stuff, but I do. I am going to be trying it on Pro Tools 9 as well. So without further ado, let's jump right into it and have a little listen to what this does. So that's a cool little look at just how it basically, it'll, it'll pick up anything you do. You can use a flute, you can use uh, a guitar. I have tried using the guitar a little bit, and uh, with the lower strings, there was a little bit of issues where, because it's uh, harmonic content, um, it would be jumping an octave. So it would go from the root E to the uh, first harmonic, which is the E an octave up. So you'd get a boo, <laughs> which, um, which wasn't exactly what I was looking for, but all of these kinks are going to get smoothed out, and I just love the way that it works at the moment. Uh, and it's a really, really fun thing that you can play around with. Now, without further ado, I, I want to just show you guys some of the features that we have in the alpha so far, and uh, that you know uh, are you know probably going to be smoothed out. There are some kinks, but you know. Get on that Kickstarter page, put down your 20 bucks, or however much you want. You'll get, you know, a free copy. You'll get a copy of the beta. 
um, and be a part of, of, of creating this this software that that basically is it's aiming to just make music making accessible and to be able to you know put down an idea without having the keyboard in the way if you're not a pianist I'm you know I'm not a keyboardist I don't know how to play uh, a keyboard effectively so so it, it's all about removing barriers from the from the creative process so that you can just you know have that idea in your head and and hum it because that's how we that's how we express our ideas uh, now one cool thing I want to do is I want to hit this thing here which is a vibrato now the way this works uh, as I've understood is that it affects the mod wheel so without unmuting this I'm just gonna hum something and then we're gonna look at the mod wheel down here in contact <laughs> So you see, it's 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 modulating. Uh, it's it's sending MIDI information to the mod wheel, which is really really cool. Also, you have a pitch bend. Which needs a little bit of work, but you can see basically. Which is really cool. Which, which I find awesome. And what I really like, and this is one of the things that I found to be most exciting and most promising with this um, product so far, is this little speech box here, which basically is the expression control. Now here you can set a range, and the range is basically um, at between what volumes is, are gonna translate into what velocities. So, for this to work properly, we're going to load up some strings. So yeah, that's Imitone, guys. Uh, check out the Kickstarter page. I'm going to link it in the description below. There's going to be more Imitone videos coming up because I'm going to be playing around with it and we're going to follow follow a little bit of the development. So when we get new versions out, I'm going to talk talk about you know uh, what kind of fixes are, are coming along, how this is progressing. And for God's sakes, if you, if you find this to be a cool idea and you want to see it succeed and you want to help out, you know, smooth out the kinks, uh, show your support. However much you feel like, um, and it really, really helps Evan uh, and the guys that he's working with to be able, you know, to give us the most streamlined, um, usable product that that they possibly can. And I, for one, I'm super excited about this. I'm super, super, super excited. So uh, yeah, check uh, check out for more videos and uh, like and subscribe.